Good afternoon, punters. Welcome to the racing edition of Spruikers. Jake, you've taken the cardigan off. I have. W warming into things this afternoon. Yeah, you were, you were, you were hating me right up. I don't know what it was. Uh, Pretty hot. Put under the collar. I'm yeah. hot too. Yeah. It's the Underwood Stakes at Caulfield this Saturday, and Weekend Hustler takes on Like Fantastic again. Mm -hmm. But this time, and for the first time, beyond 1,600 metres, and Weekend Hustler is going to start a hot favourite around the dollar sixty-five, dollar sixty mark. Yeah. I think it might tighten. Yeah, possibly he will. Yeah. If, he, if he can get upwards of that price you just mentioned towards the money mark, then snaffle that for sure. He wins. He wins. Yeah. He, he does win. It's a good field, though. Maldivian, $6.50. Light Fantastic, $9.00. Pompey Ruler, 12 And Zarita, who, was a very good, who had a very good run two weeks ago, um, $18.00. Her run was great, and so was the run of the third place horse <coughs> in that race, Latorio. He will be probably $40, $50 thereabouts on Saturday. Um, Each way? Yeah, I'm not sure if Caulfield really suits him, but yeah, on that, that was a slasher. And the further he gets, the better. So it could be worth an each way nibble. And the reports are that Weekend Hustle is going very well, mm. trained the house down on Tuesday morning yeah. and, um, and should win. Mm. $1.60 a good price? Uh, well, we can buy six tenths of a house, three fifths of a house. Fair enough. The Sarupa Using Ross McDonald's. He's pretty, he's pretty confident again. Yeah. Uh, Sir Rupert Clark Stakes and Bonhoeffer, who was a last start winner at um, 1200 Yes. Yeah, correct. Now stepping up to fourteen hundred, which is more of a more of his distance. Yeah. Five dollars fifty. Uh, Bonhoeffer, King de Car, who's the first emergency here. Eight dollars. Uh, Orange County, Serious B, got to have heart. Turf on the next best, all around the eight to ten dollar mark. Um, interesting race here. Serious Speed, I thought was going to be primed to run well fresh last start up the straight at Flemington. Well, she ran behind Bonhoeffer. Yeah, they'll both quite first fancy up. Her yeah, I like her here as well. She's undefeated second up tags, yeah. and she's a very, very smart mare. So, yeah, I give her every chance. But uh, there's going to be 15 horses in this field that are sort of $20 or under. It's that even. You could throw a blanket over them. But uh, Bonhoeffer, when a miss in the autumn, he's a stallion, and, and um, the reports were that he may have been ready to shuffle off to stud. And, Is that uh, right? He had other things. Serve, like, serve uh, a few mares, but um, um, he's come him. back. He's still a stallion. They haven't gelded him. And, he flew first up, yeah. won this, bolted into this race last year. Uh, Nicky yeah, Nero was good. unlucky. Nicky Nero's right. another one who's going to be probably above the odds. But, um, yeah, like I said, it's Good Caulfield runner. Yeah, absolutely. Um, throw a blanket over them, but, yeah, have something on serious speed each way. It's the Guineas Preludes, which we haven't got um, tissue prices for you here as well, but mm. um, they will be obviously a very good guide to the Guineas yeah. in a few weeks' time. Um, a couple of the other races, or certainly one race that's going to be another good guide to the Guineas, is the T Rose Stakes up in Sydney. Mm. And the very impressive Samantha Miss is going to start a warm favourite, $1.65. Yep. Um, in early markets, Stripper and Portillo, $4.60 and $5.50, respectively. I don't think Samantha Miss can be beaten. Uh, well, I think she can. There's no such thing as a moral, even though Jim I declare about Jim three and things and every week. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, you're right. She'll be very, very difficult to beat and will be a prohibitive price as a result. Um, my only query in this race is the fact that the well-named stripper uh, ran against the boys last time. Yeah, um, a, good run, a good run. Yeah, too. exactly. She ran a good race um, against against the lads, so I give her some hope, and I think she's probably the best value in the race. But Samantha Miss, the heading for the Caulfield Guineas, perhaps with her, and she was also the only filly entered for the Cox Plate. So it'd be nice to see her in the Cox Plate with. Zero weight on her back. Yeah, that's right. I mean, she yeah. costs squillions as a yearling, so she's obviously a high-class filly, but, um, yeah. Yeah. We've, we've got the Stony Bridge Stakes listed here as well, which suggests that you've got a fancy here. We've got... Um, well, there's, just, there's a few of the spring fancies are involved. That's right. Nom de Jure, who's the AJC Derby winner from this year, the runner-up in that race, Red Ruler, and, of course, the star, Princess Coke. Princess Coke. Um, so, I, yeah, I mean, I thought uh, across the ditch... Could be worth having a little nibble because they, these horses will be coming over to run in the spring riches. You've just taken words right out of my mouth. Fritzy Boy, $3.80. Nom de Jure, $4.20. Princess Cope, $4.00. And Red Ruler, $8.00. Um, in the long-range markets, uh, Septimus has been backed in uh, from long prices now that he's been cleared to come over here. He mm -hmm. won very easily in a, in a race that perhaps has been given a bit more credence than it should. Yeah. Um, lay for mine. Oh, I'm not going to lay him, but I'm not going to back him either. Come uh, on, stick your neck out. Yeah. Uh, no. Just for your punters' information, the Cox Plate Weekend Hustler heads the market $3.25, Maldivian $9.20, Light Fantastic $10.50, uh, which is a pretty big price actually on one bad run. It is, but I'm, ha I'm all happy to say that I like Weekend Hustler in the Cox Plate. You like good as good as good things? Starting the bleeding, obvious. And the Caulfield Cup Weekend Hustler leads that market as well $3.30, Maldivian $10, Pompey Rule at $19.50, and the very impressive Guillotine $18.50. But I hope in the Cup. Take a breath, Tag. Take a breath. I can't, I just want to get off. Well played. We'll see you again next week.